No way. No way. Oh. You, you, you see that one? Welcome back to JR Pro Shop Vids. Today we got my younger brother Jacob, or as you guys know him, Jimu, throwing the brand new Outer Limits from Radical. So we got an asymmetric hybrid here with the Outer Limits core, and also with the HK22 hybrid cover stock. So out of box, this ball comes out at 2000 grit. Jimu found that to be just a little bit too early for his liking, so he's bowled a couple games on it, got some lane shine on it, and he thinks that he found the perfect medium for it. Today, he's comparing it to his Envy and the Defender Hybrid. Starting with the Envy, right now it's his hook monster. If he wants to see the ball turn, this is the ball that he goes to. It's super early, super strong, and gets to the pin super hard. He's also got his favorite ball for house shots here, the Defender Hybrid. Currently the favorite hybrid in his bag. He loves throwing it as much as he can. The colors look really good down lane, so it's gonna be really interesting to see how the outer limits compares. It's also worth mentioning that this Defender Hybrid also has the same base cover stock in the HK22 Hybrid. Bowling on a house shot today, for us that's our 42 foot carbon. It's super easy, tons of miss room. If I can strike on it, so can basically any other bowler on the planet. So you'll probably see Jimu throw quite a few strikes today. All right, enough from me. The ball looks sweet, let's go see how it rolls down the lane. Welcome back, Jimu is back on the lanes here today with the new Outer Limits from Radical. Jacob is super, super excited for this ball because it's an asymmetrical hybrid. Wow, I can't wait. Let's first start with my big hook monster currently. It is the Hammer Envy. We're here today on Carbon, our house shot 42 feet. Should see a lot of strikes, but you never know. Let's start with this. Decent shot. That Hammer Envy is so strong. No matter what I do, if I throw it outside, it'll hook. Throw inside, it'll hook, unfortunately. But it's a great ball and the strongest ball in my bag right now. The house shot will give us a lot of forgiveness, so if we miss, should be fine. Still hit the pocket. Throw one more from there. Oh, just your average normal strike right there. I hit that ball properly that time, and you can see as soon as it hits the friction, it snaps pretty hard. That's what you expect out of your big hook monster, right? Hey, hey, yeah, okay. Next up, let's throw the new ball. It's the Outer Limits. I'll throw it on the same lineman as the Envy. Since it's a hybrid, we should expect it to go a bit later down the lane before it starts to hook. Good shot. Oh yeah. Okay, as you can see, I got to a similar break point, similar spot on the lane, but that one snapped much harder off the back. Mainly because the hybrid has some pearl in it, right? It's a both solid and pearl together, hybrid. So once that pearl sees the friction, it's gonna snap hard. Let's move two left, try to strike. Beauty, that's the perfect line for it. So the Envy probably could hook and strike from that same line, but it's just a different shape. Outer limits, bit sharper. Envy, bit smoother. Now let's go down to my favorite hybrid, the Defender Hybrid from Brunswick. This is my favorite ball to use on house shots because it's smooth, it's snappy, it does everything. So let's try it out, same line. Got it outside a little bit. And it still came back and struck. A lot of dry boards out there. So even if I leak it right, it's gonna hook back. Let's try it again. There you go. Whew. Missed inside a little bit on that one, but it drove right through the pin, just how I like it. Now you can tell this Defender Hybrid 
is a bit smoother than the Outer Limits, at least to my eye. I see the Outer Limits hooking a bit harder off the back when the Defender Hybrid is a bit smoother. We're gonna take the Envy, move another three off that one, slow it down slightly, keep everything else the same. Good shot. Hit it! Oh! Almost hit it there. Looks like it's not gonna hook, and then boom, it just hits you with the hook. It's insane. I love that ball. Biggest change to my game recently is with Coach Chai. See the vid coming soon with Simu. But I got a lesson from Coach Chai, ex-Team Canada coach, and he switched me to fingertip, mainly to preserve my fingers and help with a little bit more longevity for them. And then also, it allows me to have a bit more touch, especially when I'm playing straighter, which we'll get to in a bit. Same line as that Envy that left the 10 pin. Let's strike. You see that one? That was, woo, that was sweet. That one picked up right where I wanted it to. It read the mid lane and drove so hard right into the eight pin. One more time, encore. Oh, stone nine emoji. Good shot, could be a little bit angular, especially with the slower speed. It makes the angle a bit sharper, but still, like that ball. Somewhere in the video, question time with Jimu. This is the Outer Limits, and as I said right before this, I had my fit changed just recently, and it was a pretty big change too, going from putting my finger in just past the first knuckle and now only to the first knuckle. Definitely change in feeling and how I throw the ball. So when was the last time that you had a dramatic change in your fit or in your bowling game itself? Let me know down in the comments below. Go to the Defender Hybrid. Same line, same speed, same rotation. New ball. Yep. So I can see the Defender Hybrid's able to cover the same amount of boards as these hook monsters. However, it's just a bit smoother and I feel like if I were to go further left, it wouldn't do as well. If you could picture it, I see the Envy hooking the earliest and smoothest. Then we got the Outer Limits that hooks the latest and snappiest. And we have the Defender Hybrid just in the middle. It goes later, but it's also pretty smooth. So we were on 35 right there. We're gonna go to 25. Flatter release, change the rotation a little bit, but not much. Still want to have a little. Oh yeah, oh yeah. So. Smooth, that ball is really smooth. It's definitely gonna pick up in the friction and drive really hard. That's just, look at it, it's a hook monster. I don't expect the outer limit to do too great playing a straighter line. Never know till we try. Same line. No way, no way. Why is this ball so versatile? That's insane. Not sure if it was me or the ball. I'm pretty sure the ball, it looks like it was a Hooking, about to hook harder, and it stopped right in front of the pocket. I think that's called touch, what Goots told me. I don't know. Let's try it one more time. You see that? You see that? I see that. You see that, oh. Oh, it's solid. oh my. Thank you, coach. To say the least, that ball is really good. So the Defender Hybrid, this one should look really good from here too. Ooh, all right, all right. Similar line, Defender Hybrid is smoother, like we said, compared to the Outer Limits. So when the Outer Limits was ready to hook and stop right in front of the pocket, the Defender Hybrid fell a little bit short and didn't even get to the pocket. Kind of a half hit there. I'm ready to wrap up. Let's throw one more shot with Outer Limits. Send it back to the shop. Whoa, it fell. Let's go back. Jimu is back from the lanes. We threw this new Outer Limits from Radical. And boy, oh boy, this is a sweet looking bowling ball. Not only is it visually appealing, it looked really good on the lanes today. Now, comparing this ball, we had the Hammer Envy. This is the strongest hook monster in my arsenal today. I have it read the lanes on any pattern really early and it hooks a lot overall. And then we threw the Defender Hybrid and this bowling ball is smooth for a hybrid bowling ball. And it allowed me to play multiple lines on this house shot. 
And then we threw this Outer Limits from Radical. And I gotta say, this ball was striking from every part of the lane. When I played far inside, I was able to slow my speed. It was a bit sharp for my liking, but it drove through the pins really hard. As we got towards the right side or the outside part of the lane, it was able to roll and pick up in the friction and then just stop right in front of the pocket. I love that reaction and it carried all 10 every time. I gotta say, this HK22 base cover stock is just beauty. It's on this Defender Hybrid, it's on this Outer Limits, it looks good, and I feel like it rolls in the perfect spot on the lane. For me as a two-hander with a lot of rev rate, I'm looking for balls that Give me some control on the lanes. And this ball did exactly that for me. I could play multiple part of the lanes and it was very responsive to my hand positions and my speed changes. I would suggest throwing this ball in maybe game two or three of league or a tournament. It's not gonna be the first ball out of your bag. That's where you wanna use your solids, your hammer envy. For me, my phase two, always the first ball out of my bag. But this ball would be really good to step down to right after that. It's gonna go a bit later than your solids, but it will have a bit more in the back end, which I like seeing when I'm trying to control the pocket. In terms of oil patterns, on the house shot, it looked beautiful today, but so did every other bowling ball that I throw. I suggest throwing this ball on medium to long patterns. I don't think it's a ball for the short. I think it's just a bit too sharp off the back end. However, if you're looking to throw it on the medium and long, it might suit your game really well. So in conclusion, this bowling ball was able to keep up with the Hammer Envy, which is insane because this is my hook monster. It covered the same amount of boards, just a bit later and sharper, which is exactly what you want a hybrid bowling ball to do. Thanks for watching everyone. Make sure to like, subscribe, and comment down below. When was the last time that you had a major change to your fit? For me, it was just recently, last weekend actually, and it feels really good and I'm excited for my game in the future. But you let me know when was the last time that you got a major change. Thanks again. Jimu out. See you in the next video. Good shot. Hit it. Got it outside a little bit. There you go. Ooh. Good shot. Whoa.